In this video tutorial, I'll be showing you how to edit out objects from your images in the GIMP picture editor in two ways. First thing, for the first way in, uh, involves using the healing tool over here. I'll go ahead and make a uh, hold the left control key of my keyboard and make a selection on, on top over here. What's this going to do is going to copy this pattern um, as um, over the area that I uh, left click and hold, for example, over here. And if I move the mouse cursor down, you'll notice that above the selection is following my mouse cursor. So if I let go, it goes back, and you can see that the heel is um, is basically perfect. I can't tell there used to be a pineapple um, in that area. Another option that you have and involves the heel. Um, if you go to filters, go to enhance, go to heel selection. It involves this particular filter. In order to use it, use the uh, free selection tool, or make you just need to make a selection around that particular area that you want to heal. Oops, let me go ahead and do that like so. Okay, it's rough, but the closer you make the selection, the better. So go ahead to filters, enhance heal selection. So basically, it's going to take 50 pixels from around the selection. You can adjust this as you'd like, and you can choose whether you want it to take the sample from the sides of the image or selection, and or above and below the selection. I'll keep it to all around. In the filling order, you have some options here: inwards towards center or outwards towards center. But I'll keep it random. I'll go ahead and hit the OK button, and you'll notice it also works pretty well. But in this particular image, you'll see that the healing tool did a better job. If I go to select none. You can see there, uh, like a distinct, um, what would you call, a shadow or, you know, it, from afar it looks fine. But if you look, uh, if you zoom in, you can tell there use there may have been something in that particular area. But where the healing selection tool, or not healing selection tool, the healing selection plugin shines is in a complex image that has random patterns, not like a uh, guessable pattern let me go ahead to let me see okay let's choose this image and so I'm gonna take out this man from this image okay and I'm gonna go ahead and use the uh, rectangular selection tool for speed make a selection roughly here that's fine I'm gonna leave the, his upper body intact I mean not I'm not gonna select his upper body I'll show you why I'll go ahead and add to the current selection and go ahead and get his arms like so so I'm leaving out the planes of um, his body like for example there's a horizontal plane here and there's a horizontal plane here I'm not taking from those because I don't want to take samples from the sky or the water just from around the area this man is so I'll go ahead to filters enhance and go to heal selection and then I'm going to not take a sample from all around but only from the sides and keep it at random and go ahead and make the healing and basically for the rest of the image for example his head you do the same thing with uh, maybe samples um, from all around that's fine and then do a healing with the you would use the uh, the healing tool over here so you see that the uh, pattern over here is you know it's pretty good it, it doesn't look too bad the person can't immediately guess there used to be a body over here now to get rid of his head alright let's see to get rid of his head I'm just gonna make a general selection over here that's fine it doesn't have to be perfect again I'm gonna take out portions with the subtraction mode over here so if I go ahead select make a selection here it'll subtract that from the previous selection this is just the way I do it to um, save time but if you have time you can use the free um, free selection tool so once I've made this selection go to um, filters go to enhance and go ahead and heal, uh, choose heal selection and th since it, uh, there's like a cloud all around it doesn't matter at this point whether you take from above or below so you can choose all around and hit the OK button so I uh, almost healed it perfectly like this area is fine but we need to feel, uh, fill this area up to make it look organic so you will now choose the not clone tool but the heal selection tool zoom out make sure you select to none and so we need to find the area of the map or the area of the mountain that we can replace with the with that area 
let's say maybe from here this doesn't look too bad I'm gonna choose change the size of my selection to maybe this a little bigger yeah this is fine I'll uh, choose this area let me think for a moment maybe this area I'll go ahead and start from here and then just follow it up if it's if you don't get it the first time that's fine just keep uh, trying until you make a good uh, uh, until a good pattern forms like this so this doesn't actually look too bad like that lighting over here is the only thing that stands out but otherwise it look there you can't tell there used to be a person in this particular area now to you do something similar uh, in this um, for his, uh, reflection Thank you for listening. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comments below. I'd appreciate it if you like and share this video and subscribe to my channel. Bye.